I might go get that RS Camaro that I was looking at yesterday and throw these rims on there. Well, these going back on this car because I think these rims actually made this car value go up. All right, y'all. Let me get to work. I don't know what he want to do with it, but he going to throw the rims on there. And I don't know what else he going to do to it. Lucky's wheels and deals. We back at it again with another little video, you guys. So today I'm mobbing in the Monte Carlo. I'm taking these rims. I mean, they look cool with these rims, but they don't look better than what some other rims look like. Plus, I don't know what to do with some other rims. I thought about putting saving them and putting them on the uh the uh the other Monte Carlo, but I want to I want to put different type of rims on that car. So I don't know. I'll probably save these I Rock for another vehicle. I mean, they look cool. They look good. Matter of fact, I just thought about it. I might go get that RS Camaro that I was looking at yesterday and throw these rims on there. I might I might do that. I might not. I don't know. I don't know yet, but. I'm about to go today and put those, go get, put them 24s back on there. But I'll buy another car, throw those rims on there, to add to the collection. I kind of like that RS Camaro stick shift, so it's kind of like, I don't think like, uh, no. Nah. You know what I mean? It's kind of like, uh, I don't know. But um, anyways, guys, I'm going to go in here and see what they got. I did not do a walk around yesterday, so I do not know what they have up here. So anyways, let's go figure it out. Let's get it. Boy, I ain't never seen one of these here before. Oh yeah, yeah, the WRA. at this hood Man, oh, let's see so I clearly didn't get anything I'm up out of here I think these are my favorite shoes of all time. I think I think these are my favorite shoes of all time. And not for the comfort, I just like the look and the design of them. I don't know, when I was little, everyone used to have them. And uh, yeah, them things were too damn expensive for my mom to be buying. So, but anyways, I had to get them, man. I bought these, I don't know, one of these. I think these came out 2015. I don't know what they, they say. Let me see what they say. They say the dates on there. Let's see. Yep, 2015. 04, 22, 15. Size 11 and a half. So yeah, I bought these 2015. I still got them. So, but anyways, and I'm not a shoe collector. I'm going to wear my stuff. But I might be start collecting some cars. But yeah, man, I'm, I'm, man, I'm debating. Should I go get that RS? I really like automatics, man, to be honest with you. But I think I do want to go and test drive that. Yeah, man, I've been doing so much. I'm burnt out, tired. Let me just go ahead and put these rims back on there and I'll figure out something. But I might go over there. Pop's talking about he might, Pop's talking about he want that Firebird or that Camaro, the RS. I'm, I'm thinking the Camaro. Hey, what do you want? Well, the other dude want four thousand. Y'all comment below. And let me know. Do want four thousand for that Firebird? Um, and the other dude want what sixty-five for that Camaro? So y'all kind of. I'm a uh, Chevy guy, so I'm gonna say the Camaro and it's the RS. The Firebird is not a Trans Am, so and they both got the same engines. 
but I don't know, I like that thing got, got that fresh paint on it, though, so I don't know. He didn't even put it online, it's not online yet. I had to go over there and give him a cash offer and just get that thing. To be honest with you, he didn't post it online. It looked pretty clean, they did a good paint job on it. Uh, got the hood pins on there. It look, it look, it look good. You know what I mean? It looks good. It ain't an 87 or nothing like that, but it's a cool car to have. You no, know, Pops, he trying to buy everything. Huh? Thank God I got my, uh, come on, man. I like mobbing in this thing. All right, yeah. Uh, let's see, no, no foot on the pedal. Let's see, can we crank it right up? Starts up like a champ every time. Every time. Woo. So yeah guys, we're taking these rims off. For those I missed yesterday's video, put these on there. These did not fit the Chevelle. Um, I was very disappointed, but I ended up ordering me some rims. I ordered the same rims for my Chevelle. Man, why is it foggy? All right, so these going back on this car because I think these rims actually made this car value go up. These rims is cool and all, but I think I want to put these. I'm gonna say these rims. I might get me an RS Camaro. I might go buy that RS Camaro. I just got to my dad. I like, I don't know, probably. I'm think, really thinking about going over there and getting that RS Camaro. I'm try to give him an offer and see if we can make that happen. But. I might just get it because I just want it in the arsenal, in the fleet. Even though it's, I think it's a 91, I think. That's a good year because that's like the RS, the good RS year. I kind of wish the spoiler was a little different or not. I don't know. But uh, we're going to handle this first and then I think I'm about to say these rims for something. I don't know, man. I just want to get my collection up, man. The money keeps flowing. The money's going. And uh, yeah, man, we're going to keep shit lit. I kind of want to find me a, I don't know if I want to buy me a box Chevy. But I don't know if those IROCs would have been on a box Chevy. I don't, I don't know, like, like night and day. Look at that. It's big difference. Big difference. Night and day. Day and night. I don't know why this thing get foggy. Day and night, night and day. Oh. All right, man. I mean, these look cool and all. They look good. But the IROCs look basic and black. They look basic. I ain't gonna lie. Now, these are my new favorite. Now, these are my new favorite rims. My new favorite rims. We put them on everything. No, I ain't gonna put them on everything. But for my main, for Monica, I don't know what I'm gonna name this car. <laughs> I might have made her Carla. And how many Carlas I had, y'all? I had like five different Carlas. So I might name her Carla and keep the other one Monica. Got Carla and Monica. Mm -hmm. We got Roxanne back. I might need to get that RS, man. The Rally Sport. Turn that into my drift car. I don't know, but a stick shift, that's the only thing. But it makes it different from my other IROC. I mean, even though that's not IROC, but it makes it different got different body kit so it makes it a whole different car so i might go for it we'll see only time will tell all right guys we got them back on there man got my boy over here man put up yeah y'all see it i got told him i'm gonna go ahead and leave these rims here probably go buy that camaro like i said we'll be back we back in the game like ea baby yeah i had i had to do it man I had to do it. It makes the car look all the way different. It livens up the car. It needs that extra pop. Plus, I might, I'm probably going to change this color, though. I actually watched his video last night. I was like, damn, he had it black with silver. That actually looked good. So I might, I might go that route with it. I don't know. We might go with a black and silver thing. Go with the, that good old Raiders colors. You know what I mean? Since y'all know I'm from the bloop, 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 from the bay. Oh, look, I didn't know you was from the Bay. 
I ain't know you're from that yay area, man. What is that? If you know, you know. Okay. All right, I'll holler at y'all a little bit. Let's get it. Since he got to beat these rims up and to get these uh, locks off, I mean the center caps, he probably gonna end up destroying these rims or torching them off. I don't know how he gonna do it, but uh, what I need to do is, oh, I need to unload these rims. So I got these rims, this is all over there. Well, take those hundred spokes off. I said he was gonna get them off anyways. So I'm gonna load these things off, man. I'm gonna show y'all the rims. Y'all remember the rims that was on the Cadillac? If y'all don't remember, I'm gonna show y'all the rims. I'm gonna just go ahead and pull right here. All these mugs off real quick before I get up out of here. Five by, they was five by five in the Cali. What's going on, brother? What's going on, man? Oh, uh, man. Uh, where do y'all want me to put these wheels at? Okay. What's going on? Let me hold 20,000. Richard brother. back there taking a shit. You taking a shit, Smoggy? Smoggy! <laughs> what you doing back there? Oh. These are the ones that came out the Cadillac. I didn't realize these were five by five, and that's the same boat right there. Is Where's it? One? Yeah, five by five. I thought the Apollo was five on four and a half. Five four yeah. patterns. Shift oh, okay, so yeah, this got the five on five and the five on four and two Okay. Oh. So what do you want me to do with them nasty things? Do you want to pick them up after I get them off? What? Nobody asked why our wheels. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Okay. All right, y'all. Let me get to work. Let me get over here and show y'all. Y'all guys don't know this is Pot's uh, vehicle. I don't know what he want to do with it, but he gonna throw the rims on there, and I don't know what else he gonna do to it. But probably ain't gonna do nothing to it. He just wanna, he probably drop mobbing around like this. I ain't gonna lie. Put the rims on there, clean it up, make sure it run good. That's probably about it. Get it tuned up. He says I got an '89. One of them 89 350 motors on it. Ooh -wee. Ah, it is hot out here. So shout out to Pops and his girl uh, for dropping off that uh, that lifted Silverado. And I'll probably get footage of that later or tomorrow or whatever. Damn, no gas in this. Oh no, I'm out in the country and I'm. Circles until the tides blast. I'm the winner like, hey, hey, cuss, cuss, on the hood of the scraper.